Federal government done ready to sign $321 million agreement to return money where Abacha steal. Nigeria Center for Disease Control talks say coronavirus Nova show face for inside Nigeria. Kidnappers don't caput one seminary student where they been kidnapped inside Kaduna. And they don't bab one person where they suspect say he won't bomb church for Kaduna State. My people, good afternoon and thank you so you join us for As It Take Happen this afternoon. My name is Nna Douglas. And for the first story we carry come for now, report talks a federal government will sign one agreement with the United States of America and the island of New Jersey to help return $321 million will be four before head of state will on Caput, General Sani Abacha, been still. Talk talk person for Attorney General of the Federation and Minister for Justice, Abubakar Malami, where he named now Dr. Umar Gwandu. Now he yanned this one for one talk paper on Sunday, say the minister will sign the agreement on behalf of federal government inside Washington, D.C., and the signing will happen this week. Gwandu talk say Malami don't travel out from Nigeria on Sunday to attend one three-day meeting between United States. States Nigeria by National Commission will go happen for Washington, D.C. And, uh, and uh, for the meeting, the signing go happen. He adds, say, this meeting where they happen every year between Nigeria and the U.S., now to use and cross-check the friendship between the two countries and to find ways we go make their relationship, they cajad, especially for every diplomatic area. And for the next one, the Nigerian Center for Disease Control, where everybody know as NCDC, talks, say, the one when news they work out for town say coronavirus don't enter Nigeria, he say nothing like that. They tell Nigerians, say, make them forget about the story, sake of saying a rumor it be. NCDC on top one statement on Sunday talk say, the case of one Chinese man who returned to Nigeria from China last week, he say that the company where they work for Nigeria tell and say, make he go hospital to go check himself whether he carry corona come back. But alas, they can't understand, say, he no get the disease. Then for that, uh, talk, say, they don't ready to open where they go test sample where they collect from people will show signs, say, they get the disease. NCDC, can they advise Nigerians, say, make them shine their eyes and read about every information we concern coronavirus so that they go they safe from this wicked disease. They also advise people when they travel from China, say, I beg, if anybody, they do, they do anyhow or they do somehow for their body, make them sharply report to NCDC through their communication center. And for the next story, as authorities for the world on the battle to fight coronavirus making no spread, Wazobia Max TV correspondent Dumebi or Dumegu join us live from Kano to tell us how they take the tackle the disease so that it no go enter Kano. And uh, if um, our correspondent don't ready, Dumebi, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Dumebi. Yes, the fear of everybody now, now uh, from last half if I will come last week, now, now coronavirus. Uh, what thing they happen for Kano? How did they take, try to stop this uh, disease from coming into Kano State or Nigeria? Well, uh, for inside of the Kano, so far so good. The badness of coronavirus never enter Kano State. Although the Ministry of Health, they might talk they don't really start all those uh, many, many and they don't go on high alert to see, say, the way last Africa has take them with surprise. They don't say they don't want to make this coronavirus come use backyard way, come use and say, one went over the camera. As me and uh, the public health director, and I'm the Dr. Imam, as we talked this morning, he come out contact, say, even as he say the case never enter Kanu, and even as he say Lagos State, been, they get one kind of small gist like that yesterday. Say, uh, even like, as the coronavirus don't show face or show, they don't come out contact, say, and lie. He might talk, say, Kanu State government, now together with the health ministries, and other serving us on top of the matter, they don't put head together, stand, red alert, and attention to make just the coronavirus in not smell over the canal. Okay, um, thank you, Dumebi, for that one where you give us on um, top the update of coronavirus. And I uh, would pray say, make that kind of wicked disease not enter Nigeria. Thank you. And for other news, police inside Kaduna State talk say they don't grab one man with dangerous items when they suspect in a bomb, which you know they call improvised explosive device inside one church for Savon Tesha area for Chikun local government area inside Kaduna State. Police talk talk person for the state, Yakubu Sabo tell Tori people say the suspect when named Nathaniel Samuel, security people catch him inside Living Faith Church during one, on, one Sunday when church service been they go on. He said they don't carry the suspect go to the criminal investigation department so that he go go ask, answer many, many questions on top 
how, where, and who sent them to go kill people. And for another story, we resemble that one. They don't kill one of the four seminarians when they kidnapped for the Good Shepherd Catholic Major Seminary for Kakao Village along Kaduna Abuja Highway. Registrar for the seminary will be Reverend Father Joel Usman will confirm this badness killing for one top paper toxic, then discover the dead body of the seminarian inside one bush on Sunday. But as it be, police authorities talk say, uh, then we don't later release three other people where they've been kidnapped. And I go remember, say, government been kidnapped the Catholic seminarians for 10 January 2020. The government will be in show face inside the school, come begin to shoot gun everywhere to put fear and pursue people come out for the area where they later kidnap these four seminarians from their hostel. And still on security matter on top this level, one joint body will be uh, Christian Association of uh, Nigeria will be said they are presido. Now, Reverend Samson Ayokunle, you don't call federal government, say, make them a beg end these plenty security issues where Nigeria they face. Reverend Ayokunle, where you this one on, uh, to Tory people for the end of three days special fasting and prayer for Nigeria on Sunday, tell government, say, I beg, make them improve why people go stay uh, where they go stay and uh, criminal people can't they disturb them. Say, I beg, make them. Uh, improve, say their best, no they good enough. The camp president can also call head of security joint body, say make them bring new strategy to fight criminal badness, even as in C say, you don't get any reason why people go stay for kidnappers' hand for many days. Because they beg politicians say, I beg. Then they tell Una say, make Una know they use people's life, they play politics. And for another one, General Overseer for the Redeemed Christian Church of God will be Pastor Enoch Adejare Adeboye. On Sunday, now, so he lead members for the church on top one worker against security situation and the Kilikili where they happen inside Nigeria. The worker being happened for end of the monthly Thanksgiving service will happen for their national headquarters inside a booted meta for inside Lagos State. Adeboye nine lead for front as they start the worker from a Butem Meta through a town cemetery inside Yaba and back to the church. And no be smarting. Adeboye talks say this prayer worker now to use and talk to God, say make it save Nigeria from the hand of bad people like terrorists, bandits, kidnappers, arm robbers, militants, and ritualists will be said their work now to the key people, sake of long truth for money. And for the next story, my people, the next story get to do with APC. All progressive Congress will be APC talks as it be, no territory inside Nigeria with Boko Haram they control at all, at all. APC talk talk person, Lanre Issa Onilu talks say, the talk where they walk around say Boko Haram bandits and kidnappers, they target one religion and tribe, is seen at the handwork of surface joint body and people will not get eyes to see within day. The APC talk talk person talks say, make all Nigerians check and well. The statement talks say, as they hot, no atom of Nigerian territory, they under the control of Boko Haram. Then they clear, say, then they declare bandits, kidnappers, and other criminal badness camps, and are the criminals they lose every day. Issa Onilu talks say, even though say terrorists, they attack soft targets, it's a federal government still they show them pepper, waiting a call for English. Federal government is degrading Boko Haram. Now, so Nilo Khan, they tell Joint Body of Christian Association of Nigeria, can, plus including Catholic Church, where we say Boko Haram and kidnappers been killed their members, say make them a beg sorry on top the level. My people, when I see the watch as it take happen, or Wazobia Max TV, will they come back with business news? <music> And on top business, federal government talks say they don't cancel minimum tax for insurance sector to help the sector grow. Vice President Yemi Oshibajo, now he this one for Abuja when he delivered the National Defense College course 28 lecture. Oshibajo talks say in the expect to see say insurance industry for the country grow, even as he talks say they don't remove many things inside Finance Act when they make insurance grow. He explains say people where they operate insurance, but don't they raise their voice say insurance sector no they grow at all. Just as an ad say, the one where we say they amend the tax amendment, uh, amendment, now good news for them. Before they make a law, it talks say they've been they only allow insurance companies carry forward losses for four years, even when companies for other sectors for the economy fit carry forward their losses till their kingdom come. 
The Vice President will talk say the Finance Act and the government's fiscal response to two issues will consign how to generate enough revenue money and create better space for business to grow. It remains Sports News with the show now. And the good news where they come from Nigeria talks say Enyimba don't qualify for the last eight of CAF Confederation Cup, sake of their 5-2 win against San Pedro of Cote d'Ivoire for Abidjan on Sunday. Abdurrahman Bashiri now first find trouble when he teared the net for Enyimba for the second minute and Victor Boma and the second after uh, scored the second one after one minute later. Sheriff Jimo from Cote d'Ivoire can score one goal for the sixth minute. Now, harvest of goals as Austin or Ladapo can restore Enyimba's two goal lead for the 25th minute. But as it be, like Cat and Rat, San Pedro fight back to pull another trigger inside Enyimba net through Roland Zambi before they go for half time. Enyimba can make the draws safe for second half with goals from Mboma and Stanley Dingba. As it be, the People's Elephant finished second as in the follow Morocco Sassania Agadir for Group D with 10 points. Closest group opponents, Paradu AC from Algeria, finished third with eight points after the Mpoko, the group winners, will be Hassania Agadir. My people, now the story be that, but make we tell on our top story again. <music> Federal government don't ready to sign $321 million agreement to return money where Abacha steal. Nigeria Center for Disease Control talks say coronavirus never show in ugly face for Nigeria. Kidnappers on Kaput one seminary student with them being kidnapped inside Kaduna. And they don't grab one person with them suspect say he won't bomb church for Kaduna State. My people na so it be on top as it take happen this afternoon. My name na Nuna Douglas. Join us for two o'clock again. To enjoy more of this our Ugonge videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.